episode 18, Manchester United versus Chelsea. Now, I do want to correct this. If you've been following along, I did say episode 17 was this. Now, this is episode 18 here. Uh, we got Manchester United versus Chelsea. Let's go ahead here and check out the standings. They're a mid, mid-table team, but it's Chelsea. We're not going to sit here and take them lightly. Uh, we already know the calendar is crazy. I want to get the Chelsea game. Maybe we go into Bournemouth and kind of approach Bournemouth like, like we did the Newcastle game. Because right here, final Champions League game. Can't look too far ahead. We have Chelsea ahead of us, so uh, let's go in here and see what we're going to do. We definitely have prepared for this game. We're going to come at them with the best we got and see what happens. We purposely... Rest some guys, and thank God that we did rest them because we get a fresh start here. Diallo, not too worried about him. Bring Garnacho in. We haven't been playing him that much. Uh, we're going to have to utilize him now because I think up front it's going to have to be Rashford and Martial switching off because I would like a fresh striker every game at least, and I have faith in those two cats. Even though they only have 12 points right now, like I said, it's, it's still Chelsea. And we got to take it serious. Is that really what the fuck their kit looks like? Okay. That's kind of lame. I don't like their kit. Of course, I don't like Chelsea. Let's go get a win. We need this. Manchester City has... Oh, look at this. I love the startups of this game. Look at this. Fixing the cameras, making sure that the field is fucking all perfect. The city's coming out. Don't move a muscle. Stay with us on EA TV. I love how they do that. Now they should cut right to walkouts. Well, it really is a nope. city that We're going to get it right football. started. I'm talking, of course, about Manchester. And it's a real pleasure to be here tonight at Old Trafford. Let's see what we got. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to we'll see how good uh, Chelsea is. Partner, I'm a little shocked that they're down that low. Right Out of all the chaos Manchester on top of the United table United right now, I figured that Chelsea, Chelsea might have been in there raising some hell, too. They have not got off to the right start. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. They're going to be another team that looks like they're going to be up all over. And you know we don't handle this pressure well. We just don't. Unbelievable! How he got that on the fucking goal! <laughs> They are blitzing us 100 miles an hour right now. Wow. All right, so Chelsea's not holding back. Is this going to be their demise, though? Beautiful goal by Mount Rashford, found it perfectly. They came out of the gates right in our face. And a, 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 a slow counter attack, a slow counter attack, but calculated. Got it right there, made that little step in, beautiful. They're pulling so many guys towards the ball. This is what City did to us that we could not handle. I think that we got two different monsters here we're talking about. But this is going to be good preparation, I think, for the City game because that is exactly what they did. They don't take their foot off the gas. And the ball moving again. It definitely so came back to bite them in the ass right there, the though. Might be okay. Enzo Fernandez. Kunku has it. Oh, super piece Damn, of I fucking whiffed on that tackle. Superbly read 
and execute it. I feel like that's the thing. If I switch to my center backs, it's just a fucking disaster. And here we can get out. Here we can get out and run. Dallow. Those slide tackles are un unbelievable. There's no way in my mind, in Wildest Streams, I would have thought that that guy would have got there that ball. No way. And here they come again. Let's get credit to the defending. Oh, they want to make this fucker attract me. Rashford, why can you not fucking hit one of those? Why can he not make that shot? How? I just... I'm still shocked right now as to how. And he's done that multiple times this year where it's like an automatic goal. Just got to try to stay. You can't pursue him because at the second you pursue a guy, he's going to fucking... It's like he just becomes disconnected from the ball and just let it just float around out there for someone to. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Oh, didn't go as a plan in the end. Casemiro, man, I missed you. That Amber back, I didn't do too bad of a job for us last game, though. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, man. I definitely had that pass That's going to the wrong guy. United could be onto something. Cross fired over. Oh, well, Diallo finally got his head on one. I don't know if he's our best option for that, but. It's nice to get up on 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 an opponent first for once. It's with Diallo. For that. This could be troublesome. Oh, that's a hard save. <sighs> like, he's right there, but there's no way. If you're a good goalkeeper, you're not going to let me be your first place, and I can't come back into the box. Now there was a different story. He could go far post on that one. And oh, he didn't fucking convert. There we go. God, even there, the turn, and I'm trying to clear it. I'm trying to clear it as far as I can. And I just, I can't get on the ball. Let's see if we can't get one more possession here. Well, as you can see, United have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes. Yeah, we have, because we've kind of figured them out. It's only a matter of time before they get another. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now, a throw in. Get this shit off the fucking screen. Pass the ball. Time, but only the one minute. So 
All right, we're going to have time with the 1 0 lead. Good start. Good start. Well, I hate to Good say start. It, we were absolutely right about their defending. They just look so well organized. They squeeze up at the right time. They drop off when needed. We did. We did do an excellent job of defending. That was almost the perfect first half. Mount, hey, we asked for. Uh... Lost my train of thought there. We asked for a hero. Maybe it is Mount. Here's what we're going to do to kind of make sure that guys are going to be a little bit fit for that next game. I'm going to keep Rashford in there for a little bit. We'll see how this plays out. I might bring Martial in to relieve him. We'll see how this plays out here. Yeah, Chelsea's not going to stop. Just such a bad touch. Like, what kind of fucking touch was that? And then it just opens us up because you know we love to get our left and right balls. Here we go, right here. Juan Basaka. Throw the ball out there. That's why it's called a fucking through pass, EA. Eh? It's had nothing there. Well, I did. I fucked it all up. Uh-oh. No one out there. And he fucking let Raheem Sterling. Come on, Garnacho. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Man. Oh, they called him for that. It's advantage, Chelsea. Stupid, probably. I tried to get to the ball. It's going forward well here. Is they got? They got to card him for that? Because I definitely came in. I didn't see it. A short corner here. Ah, oh, Basaka. He ran it well defensively. Marcus Rashford. There's the chance they could get caught out on they're the They're so lucky. Yeah, they're so lucky right there. That's not who I passed that to. Why the fuck would I pass that to Rashford? They just let me walk down fucking Main Street. <laughs> I was caught off guard that I even had a shot like that. I think this is what I'm going to start doing here is pulling in a guy and kind of regrouping. If I can get a little fucking shimmy shake like that. However, we are playing this game like we do have a two goal lead and I don't like it. Just not a good pass. That's out. Let's see if we can make a move here. Bring it a little bit there. This might come back to bite us in the ass, but 
win it's going to be. With the one goal lead. Diogo Dallo. Oh, surely. Oh, and Martial comes right in the game and says, let me fucking fire one off. I fucking love that guy. Palmer with it. No let up, plenty of pressure. Oh, fuck it. Well, That's us. There we go. To press the ball. Casemiro. Not who I was Here's going to give to. Bruno Fernandes has it. Oh! King defensively. He nice fucking pass. Martial just couldn't get it and turn the other way. Uh oh, that's bad news for us. From Chelsea to win back possession. That's bad news. That's bad news. Getting down here near to the end of this one. Silva. Do we have enough? You still? Oh, did well to skip through. No one steps up. That's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. You can see it coming. You can just fucking see it coming. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and then from that sort of range, Sterling was never going to miss. It's a Maybe it's a substitute, I don't know. But you could definitely see that shit coming. Still level here, but Manchester United making a push near the end. Can he put the I packed, make the pass. Oh, you had Anthony back post. Order. Give me the right guy. And that's another thing that's really starting to fucking piss me off. Is a fucking... Give me... The right guy. Oh. He's offside! No! Not who was passing to, though! Substitution, then. Let's see how it affects the match. With that, the attack fizzles out. He's in position. Uh oh. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And swiftly ending that attack. And he has options available. Uh, why, why did I pass that? It's just fear fucking panic. <sighs> Step up! Knocking on the door in the closing minutes. So full time here. Well, the two teams are locked together. What do you do? Point to piece, a share of the sport. What do you do? Manchester United, your assessment of their performance. Well, Derek, it's a horrible feeling. What do you do? So late in the game. They thought they had the game won, but a lack of confidence. We had the game won. We had the game won and let them fucking do that shit. I, hey, we got a draw. We got a draw. Let's see what happened uh, in the rest of the games. Just try to try to keep up top as, as best as we can. If we can float around this for the most of the season here, some of the tournaments might get involved. They might not get involved, and then we'll see where we stand. But man, we had that game. We had it. We moved up a spot over Everton right now and it looks like for the first time this year Manchester's well they haven't played yet though Liverpool has a game under their belt over everybody else so let's take that off the equation and say that they are at 31 right now assuming that they won we are right there if that's the case teams are starting to even out a little bit here City doesn't seem to be so dominant 
and everything seems to be pointing towards a late late season showdown between a couple teams and I hope that we're one of those teams that is, is, is going to be a part of it so I think what do we got ahead here let's go check the calendar real quick Bournemouth coming up next episode will be Bournemouth hopefully hopefully it looks like we'll have some guys that can make that run there we're definitely gonna have to plan for the champions league game so even though we're kind of up top of the premier league we have one champions league game left after this next one so if you have been following the series please hit that subscribe button i would really appreciate it and we will see you for the next episode thanks for tuning in